My name is Roberto Hernandez, and my faith is a higher spirit. And my connection to a, high, a higher spirit is in different forms. Um, the sun is um, one of my higher uh, powers that gives me light. Um, the wind, the air, is a higher power uh, because it lets me breathe. The night, Father Sky, is a higher power for me because the sky brings me the sun, it brings me the moon, it brings me the day, it brings me the night, it brings me peace, it brings me sunlight, it brings me joy. Father Sky also blesses me with that water, that water, the rain. The water that is in our ocean, it's in our lakes, it's the water that we bathe and cleanse our bodies with. It's the water that we drink, the water that's in our bodies. The majority of my body is made of water. So that's uh, uh, my connection to, to a higher power. Mother Earth is um, another higher power. And my connection to the earth is uh, the seeds that we plant, you know, and the beautiful flowers that grow from the earth, you know, the, f the oranges, the onions, the garlic, the pears, the trees, and all the natural resources our Mother Earth gives us is um, part of my spiritual connection in, in my faith to a higher power. So I've learned through, throughout the years that, that there's no one particular, you know, um, God, mm -hmm. that God, there are different gods, mm -hmm. um, and they are in different shapes, ways, and forms, and they're all natural forces. Um, and I've been blessed to be able to tap into each one of those and learn about them and feel them and appreciate them and be grateful for them. And so on a daily basis, I, I thank our Creator for the blessings that I'm granted. Just to get up in the morning and to be alive today is a blessing. And that's where my spiritual connection begins, is every day is to pray, pray, to meditate, and to be grateful that I am given this day and that I am blessed with this day today. And everything else that, I, that comes to me today is a blessing that my creator gives to me. And I take nothing for granted today. I remember growing up, I, I took a lot for granted. And I think that from my own experiences and from my travels around the world and from studying and learning, I've been able to adapt and, 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 and reach deep inside my soul and get in touch with my soul, get in touch with my spirit, get in touch with my heart get in touch with my mind and my body all together to learn to have a balanced life. But most important is to be able to walk gently on this earth for the very short period of time that we're here. I think the, the, the biggest blessing that I have um, is to be a part of Carnaval San Francisco. Mm -hmm. Because Carnaval San Francisco, um, it's a uh, the most unique opportunity for all of us to become one. Uh, whether you're Africano, whether you're Brazilian, whether you're Cubano, Puerto Rican, Filipino, Chino, Japones, lo que sea, uh -huh. you know, Carnaval. Um, has those different um, higher powers that connect us all, whether it be the Orishas uh, that are, you know, um, in Cuba or in Brazil or in Puerto Rico, uh, or whether it be from Mexico, the Mayas uh, or the Aztecs. Carnaval brings that all together. So I, I've, I've been blessed to be the artistic director 
with with the carnival and and so i'm able to to be involved in different elements and and ceremonies and preparations um to to be able to have this annual ritual mm -hmm. and this annual procession that 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 goes down the streets and and literally uh changes the way we feel that particular day mm -hmm. it transforms people mm -hmm. and 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 a lot of people don't understand that carnival is you know, it's not about taking your clothes off and wearing skimpy clothes mm -hmm. no it's about carnival has this spiritual element and that spiritual element reaches people inside and touches their souls or spirits and gives you goosebumps mm -hmm. as you see somebody coming down the street dancing or drumming mm -hmm. because that drummer and that dance that dancer is in a whole nother spiritual world at that moment and so you feel that energy and that energy just goes out and just makes you go into another zone because at that moment you're not worried about the war you're not worried about hate you're not worried about a pg and e bill or your or your rent or food or anything but you're in that moment you know and that's what's so beautiful about kind of line and that's my connection to my community mm -hmm. is to be blessed to be a part of of a family of so many cultures that have roots that are spiritual mm -hmm. you know and so that when we dance and when we drum it's not we're just not drumming and dancing to have fun, but we're doing we're we're dancing and drumming specifically to feed our souls and to feed our spirits and to feed the soul and the spirits of others. It's by getting up in the morning and praying, meditating, being grateful, and understanding that I gotta live with love in my soul, my heart, my spirit, my mind, and my body every day, no matter what happens. Mm -hmm. And if I stay with that love in my spirit, my soul, my body, and my mind, I'm therefore able to be an example of spreading positive energy in my community. The moment I get away from that, then I become just part of all that negative energy that's out there. Mm -hmm. And so my faith is very deep, but my faith is connected to having hope, having courage, mm -hmm. understanding others rather than trying to be understood. Mm -hmm to be humble, to be truthful, to be loving, to be caring, to not make assumptions, to not get angry. Mm -hmm. But all that takes place because every day, just like we take showers and we comb our hair and we iron our clothes and we go through this whole ritual and process of looking good on the outside, mm -hmm. I've learned to spend that same amount of time to cleanse my soul and cleanse my spirit and cleanse my heart and especially my mind right because that's where it begins mm -hmm. and and doing that daily cleansing you know and letting go you know of negative things that that I hear mm -hmm. right and not going into those you know areas of being negative that daily prayer that daily meditation is what makes me who I am and and and, and that deep faith. Mm -hmm. So the, the the navigation is the way you breathe into life every day. Yeah, it's breathing life every day, and uh, it's just like your heart. Your heart has a beat, you know. Mm -hmm. If you get angry, it goes faster, mm -hmm. you know. Right. And so that that love. When you learn to love unconditionally and to love all, mm -hmm. the sick, the poor, the angry, the drug addict, the alcoholic, mm -hmm. you know, the resentful, you know, 
I've been there. I've done them all, mm-hmm. you know, and experienced it all myself. Right. You know, so I, I've I've been able to to change my life. You know, to be able to live a different way, but most importantly, to walk gently on this earth. Mm-hmm. You know, right. 